If you're registered for the MCAT, you may be thinking about taking it at a later time. It's a stressful decision. Should you reschedule? Hey guys, I'm Jack, and today I'm going to discuss when you should reschedule the MCAT by providing you with my top reasons. At some point, virtually everyone thinks about rescheduling this beast of an exam. Even if you've been studying nonstop for months, it's natural to doubt yourself. First, let's start with the most obvious. If you have barely studied a month, reschedule. You should spend at least three to four months preparing. Now, there will always be that genius test taker who can somehow look at things the right way with very little prep. But for I would say 99% of the population, you definitely need a good amount of time to get this test down. Learning from your mistakes takes time. Building endurance takes time. If you're rushing, cramming four months of work into two months, you will jeopardize your score. I don't care how committed you are to studying in a short amount of time or how smart you are or how high your GPA is. Be honest with yourself and reschedule it. Second, reschedule if you haven't done hundreds or even thousands of practice questions. If you've spent most of your time reading books, simply doing content review, you should definitely take the exam later. This is probably the biggest reason why most students retake the exam. They simply didn't have enough time to do questions. They put too much emphasis on learning the science. Big mistake. If you want to do well, you not only have to do a lot of practice questions, but you also have to review your right and wrong answers. When you do this, you start understanding the concepts at a higher level, something that passively reading books can never really give you. It also helps you build stamina and finish faster. My third reason might surprise you, but even if you went through tons of practice questions, you should reschedule if you haven't completed most of the AMC practice problems. Guys, the double AMC practice products are critical to your success. If you can't get to most of them, you will be at a significant disadvantage or at the very least score much lower. That material prepares you better than anything else out there. They are literally giving you old questions that were once on the test. Study it and go through all of them because the real thing is very similar. Let's say you do the AMC practice exams, but you can't finish them on time. That's another good reason to reschedule. You have to be realistic. If you can't finish an exam a month out, you're in trouble because you're a lot less likely to finish the actual exam. The problem could be focus or timing. It doesn't matter. You can't finish, reschedule. Let's say you can finish the AMC exams, but you notice that you're scoring really low on one or more of the sections. Don't shrug it off, reschedule. One low section score can potentially reduce your chances of receiving interviews, and that results in less acceptances. Now, if you are confident the schools you're interested in are okay with this lower score, then go for it. But why would you take an exam when you know you can do better on a section? And trust me, you can do better on cars or physical, for instance, if you work on it. I would also reschedule if you're burned out and can't find the energy to study daily. That's a sign of something outside of MCAT prep that is bothering you. And until you work on that and address that issue, your MCAT score will suffer. So to recap, you should take the exam when you have set aside at least three or four months to study full time. Now, you could spread that over a course of a year if you can't study a lot each day. You should take the exam when you've done a lot of questions and that includes all of the double AMC practice products. You should take the exam when you can finish an actual practice exam in time without losing focus. You should take the exam when you don't have any major weaknesses that can bring a section score down. And lastly, make sure you're mentally prepared with no distractions and without feeling burned out. There is no reason to rush this test. Any of the reasons I discussed justify a reschedule. And look, it's not the end of the world. It's better to postpone and take it once than to retake with a poor score. Why? Because you'll doubt yourself on this exam and confidence is everything. You will score high if you're mature and committed. Don't let anything get in your way from attaining your goals.